Hello, what's up? Good evening. Today is Saturday, April 4 at 8 p.m. So today I'm going to show you about how to use GitHub, AWS, and Laravel. So first thing we need to do is to, to write the codes in our local machine and then make some commit and then push everything in our github and then our la our our aws will automatically detect the commit in our master and then automatically also deploy in our website which is this so for now this is the face of our website and then we're going to edit something here like this one okay so it's in the home Um, let's just edit this part hello Morley and then after that let's go into our get console get status so we have um, modified our welcome blade add all make a commit updated headers after that let's push that one into our github let me enter my github credentials i didn't try to register this in global since i'm using github and git Lab. so for now our repo has been updated you can see here our commits updated headers and then check our pipelines so it already detect that there are something new in our master branch from our github then after that it analyzed here and then it's building here and deploying um, let's just wait for a few seconds in order for our website to change okay so this is a very nice or a big help for us as a developer because this is the what this is what they call a continuous integration I you just need it's just like a centralized and automated automated deployment like I, I, a group of us or a group of developer like uh, five and then we are working in a project and then we just need to push our project into our github or let's just say we have a different kind of branch then after merging everything in master our AWS will detect that we have pushed something and it automatically updated and deployed updated build and deploy into our AWS let's refresh this one okay this is hello Morley we just edited that a while ago so for this, this is a very big help for us as developer I think you already see the light on it that working as a team especially into a big corporate company startup you don't need to use chinkins you don't need to use corbettes for this continuous integration this is already in the features of aws so i hope you like the video and it helps you and it gives you information about the new style of of devops